that root 2 is an irrational number. Suppose if possible, we assume maybe that root 2 is a rational number. So we assume root 2. So we assume root 2 to be a rational number if possible. Maybe it is a rational number, maybe it's not a rational number, we don't know. But let us assume it to be a rational number. Then root 2 must be equal to a by b where a and b are integer and b is not equal to 0. Now root 2 cannot be equal to an integer 1 because 1 square is not equal to 2. Root 2 cannot be equal to an integer 2 because 2 square is not equal to 2. Root 2 cannot be equal to any integer so b cannot be equal to 1. Further, we assume that if a, were a and b were having some common factor, we are cancelling that out. So, a comma b do not have any common factor. Alright, root 2 equal to a by b and a and b do not have any common factor. So let's square it both sides to obtain 2 equal to a square by b square. Now let's take b to the right hand side to obtain 2b equal to a square by b. Since a and b do not have any common factor, b is not equal to 1. It's a fraction. Whereas this side, it's an integer. 2b, 2 times b, that's an integer. Whereas a square by b, that's a fraction. So we obtain a contradiction. Why are we getting a contradiction? We are getting a contradiction because we are assuming root 2 be a rational number. We are assuming root 2 equal to a by b. And then we are multiplying by b get to get 2b equal to a square by b, which is not possible. So we got something which is impossible. That's because we assume something which is impossible. Therefore, root 2 is a rational number that is impossible. Root 2 is not a rational number.